This is our, uh, our data collection hub. So what we're doing in here um, is overseeing the capture of all of the data from around the grounds. Uh, we'll capture about four and a half million data points during the championships and the team here are making sure that you know, every point is captured as accurately as possible. Who's it all for then? Why are you collecting all this data? What's happening as soon as they're pressing the button is that data is essentially distributed around the world. So getting the data right at source is really, really important because it drives all of the statistics you see, the scores and everything else. And the players really take an interest in what happens here. So what has the technology done to help them essentially try and win Wimbledon? Yeah, so what we try and do is take away all of their worries apart from playing tennis. Mm. So we've built them a personalised uh, website that allows them to optimise their performance. So within uh, 20 minutes of a match completing, we'll provide the players with a personalised uh, match report and a video file that embeds all of their analytics so they can both look back at how they have performed but also look forward at their next opponent. This is uh, Novak Djokovic's match from yesterday, first up on, on centre court. We can just show all the break points. Novak can look and his team can look at how did he actually execute on those points. Mm -hmm. Was he following the game plan or not? Um, how well was he following the game plan? Um, and this is just a really simple and easy tool for them to be able to you know, carry out their analysis really, really quickly. And then through the same system here that's available in the players' lounge and open to everybody, the players can then look forward in the draw and say, okay, who am I playing next? Can I see anything in their match analysis that might help me prepare for the next game? So again, they can all be at peak performance when they step out on court. How detailed is the analysis that you take in here? Um, I mean, it's hugely uh, detailed. So if we look at Simona Halep's match from yesterday, um, the statistics that you can see on screen here, this is the summary level of statistics that provided to the, the TV commentators. Um, but this breaks down um, point by point all of the information that they might want to analyse their matches available in the system. Do you think you could ever predict the winner? Um, I don't think you could ever predict the winner um, because you've also always got that element of being able to perform on the day. But it can certainly help people win um, by providing the best insights for them. Next door, Sam showed me how AI is being used to generate match highlights. So this is our AI highlights dashboard. This is what the, the digital editors are able to use to have a look at um, what are the most exciting moments that are ranked by the AI. So what it's done is it's ranked uh, the amount of crowd cheering, so how much noise are the crowd making. Um, it's a particularly important moment in the match because it's a break point in the second set. And then how animated are the players, and that gives us an overall excitement ranking for the point. So what the highlights machine is doing is it's ranking all the points and then based on some business rules it's then compiling a three minute uh, video section complete with TV graphics and putting it into the content management system for the digital editors to look at and decide whether or not they're going to publish. Despite technology and data's increasing roles at the tournament, Alex Willis, head of communications, content and digital at the All England Club, doesn't believe it's taking away from the excitement of the game. Technology is such an important part of, of the Wimbledon experience. Things like line calling, scores, statistics, data, insight. Uh, we couldn't cope without it. it. It's a great service that the club and IBM are able to offer to the players. You know, we like to think that it's a, a good combination of augmenting and enhancing what the, the player can do. But fundamentally, the purity of the sport, it is a gladiatorial sport. They still have to do that themselves.